Hey, my YouTube family. This is the Shy Town Gardener, and uh, I'm uh, sitting out here on my deck. 72 degrees, nice and comfortable. Let me give you guys a little, I guess, a panoramic view of my deck. This is my uh, sanctuary in the summer, spring, summer, and fall, when it's not too cold. Um, started my six week break. <clears throat> uh, I teach school and we, today is our first day of summer break and I am excited. I'm looking forward to uh, possibly um, doing something, some travel, just not uh, nowhere long distance, but uh, I'm excited about my garden. Uh, this is a big adventure for me because I've never uh, done anything like this on this level. I've had uh, plants, but I've never had anything of this magnitude, and I'm excited about that. Uh, I'm sitting here thinking about how I could re uh, restructure my classes come uh, in the fall. We're st we still have the uh, COVID guidelines uh, with the barriers, but there will be no remote learning. Uh, I, I feel the remote learning was a failure. It was a failure. It was a, it's a great alternative considering the circumstances that we were in, but many of our students didn't do well with that. Uh, so I'm happy that we're going back to in-person learning which is more effective. Uh, remote learning is good for emergencies like snow days or something like that. But for a long uh, period of time to be under such a, uh, uh, that type of a structure is not that effective. But you know, uh, when uh, you're hit with a uh, emergency like what we were hit with, you know, you have to do what you have to do but I'm looking forward to uh, the upcoming school year. Um, we, uh, uh, I'm excited about my garden. I, uh, I'm not excited about my apple trees though. I, I said something about my apple trees early uh, in this journey uh, that you all have been following me. Um, a lot of the tree is dead uh, I need to do some pruning and some fertilizing now this is me that knows absolutely nothing about trees so I'm thinking what I may have to do is have someone come and take a look at these trees and let me know if they're salable um, and if they are what can we do to, to spruce it up you know Anyway, <clears throat> just wanted to come to you, just share that with you. Uh, the garden is looking good. Uh, I think all of my tomato plants, even the cherry tomato plants, have uh, uh, small tomatoes on them. My strawberries are really looking good. I mean, they have really grown. I mean, the straw, not just the plants, I'm talking about the actual strawberries. Um, everything seems to be fruiting, except for the corn, obviously. And uh, so we're excited about that. And my uh, cucumbers, I haven't seen any blooms on that. And one of the reasons why I got the sunflowers and the marigolds were to try to attract pollinators, such as butterflies and bees, to help pollinate my uh, uh, plants. So we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and the rest of your week. And this is the Shy Town Gardener uh, wishing you well and saying peace out.